What's up people? This is RGC and welcome to another video. This is a pickup video. I wasn't planning to go searching for any games um recently or um anytime soon I should say. But um something told me just to check out some local stores and uh pawn shops and whatnot and good thing I listened. Uh first up one of my pickups is a CIB Mario Kart 64. Um, pretty happy to have it. It does not have an insert, but it does have everything else. I've already put it in a nice protective cover for the, uh, little sleeve to preserve the label. Um, has the, like, operations card. Has the manual right there. It's that, um, yellow manual variant. It's not the color full color manual like that one that looks just like the cover of the uh, game here but uh, the box art but I am happy to have it and it came with this and this is actually what the original manual looks like just like that but um yeah happy to have it great price good stuff and that's just the beginning of this video that's just the start so definitely a great pickup for the price I paid wasn't that expensive okay uh, next up a PlayStation 2 game I've been looking for for some time in good condition that's Rogue Galaxy um, have to have it complete minty uh, manual and disc looks great have to have it cool RPG heard good stuff about it next up um, RPG um, I wasn't planning on finding it or picking it up actually but why not it was a good price local store and that is Suicoden 3 or Suicoden 3 however you want to pronounce it complete glad to have it all right so as you can see we kind of got a little RPG thing in here anyway um moving on to a Wii pickup I picked up um Metro Prime Trilogy steel book have another copy so I have two copies of the steel book version um, this is the original print obviously with the steel book it is not the GameStop reprint so have to have it it's complete um, with the sleeve on it pretty good condition paid a little bit for it but I am happy with it and um, it's always cool to have a steel book version of that game next up local store pickup Brave Fencer Musashi um, for the PlayStation 1, happy to have it complete. Doesn't look like the main was really ever touched it besides like that corner um, damage right there. Not main thing major. Um, this looks great. Has both discs in here, even though the second one is just a uh, demo. Um, yeah, as you can see right there. But happy to have it. Great addition to my collection. Are great things about this game so have it have it as you can see we're coming with some pretty good quality stuff here like I stated um, I don't get a lot of stuff all the time but I try to keep the quality up uh, local store pickup I really don't understand why this game is so expensive other than the fact that it is popular um, and it kind of was a late N64 release and Nintendo act like this game never even existed but um, that is a uh, Conquer's Bad Fur Day. Got another copy. Um, if you know how many copies of Bad Con uh, Conquer's Bad Fur Day I have, you you know. Um, check out some other videos. But this is another copy I have. It's not a rare game. It's just an expensive one. Uh, came with the manual as well. So I guess I need to find a box for it. So whatever. Have to have it. And uh, to wrap this video up. Pretty expensive PlayStation 1 game. Um, I've seen it before in stores, but it didn't have its manual. And I am i don't collect disc-based games without the manual. If it's not complete and it's a disc-based game, I don't want it. But have to run across it. Paid a little bit for it, to say the least. But Tales of Destiny. Complete. pretty much it for this short little pickup video um tales of destiny the final final pickup of the video anyway thanks for watching peace